So we, our kids, they get more candy than they can possibly eat on Halloween. They might disagree with that, but it's true. So what do you do with the rest of it? You don't really want to throw it out. So why not send it to our troops overseas? Joining me now is Tanya Thomas from the New Haven Cool Smiles office to tell us about Operation Troop Training. Tanya, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate you having here. Yeah, it's kind of a conundrum for you in the dental industry. You don't want the kids to have all this candy because that's not good for their teeth. But at the same time, you don't want to get rid of it and you want to help people out. Yeah. How does your Operation Cool Smiles go about this? Well, we, uh, it, we have the kids bring in candy and um, then we give them toys once they donate their candy. So there's a trade out going on. Yeah. yeah. You have to put some sort of incentive for them mm -hmm. to want to bring their candy in. Yeah. Do they have a hard time parting with it sometimes? Or? Not so much. We had um, really a, a box that we put in, like, as soon as you come in through the door, and then, you know, their parents are like, you know, they give them the candy, and they tell them that it's for a good cause, so. Well, and you know. by that time, the parents are ready to do anything just to get some of that candy out yes, of there. Yes, definitely. It just goes on and on for weeks definitely. if you let it. And tell them about what the good cause is. This, goes, this candy goes where? Well, it goes to the troops um, that are overseas, and... Um, um, the kids, they just come in and they donate the candy, and then they get toys for the candy that they donate. What do you hear from the troops overseas? How do they feel about this program? How thankful they are, you know, and that people over here are still, you know, um, fighting and praying for them to um, just fight for our country. Yeah, you know, it's a really nice way to just sort of recognize them, bring them into the, 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 the Halloween uh, American spirit. sort of spirit, spirit uh, yeah. of the whole thing as we head into the holiday season as well. What are the particulars here? How many different places can people go to drop this candy off? Well, do, we, they, do they need to be, uh, they, don't, they don't necessarily have to be uh, customers of your dental no. offices, right? We have five offices here in Connecticut, uh, New Haven, Waterbury, New Britain, Hartford, um, Cool Smiles. So you can come to drop them off at any of the sites here in Connecticut, and you don't you don't have to be a patient. All right, you got a limit of three toys per child, and it all is done on a first come, uh, first serve basis uh, as well. Um, it, it, it's a wonderful program that you've got going here, and and, and I think especially wonderful in that the small children who are, are so obsessed with candy can go ahead and kind of get their first. Uh, taste of giving up something they want yes. to the greater good. Yes. Is that what you find uh, their reaction is a lot of times? Yeah, they are. They're really pleased to do it. So, you know, and, you know, they have a ton of candy that they're bringing in daily. So it's, it's really nice. If you did not catch uh, those addresses that we put up on the screen where you can do the drop off, please go to our website and you can. Wonderful to have you here.